Just give it to me straight, Doc. It is a serious case of colic, but the good thing is, is that we caught it early on, so the Vanamine that we gave him will help. Now, that does mean that you aren't going to be able to ride him for the next week. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. Um... I'm gonna speak crying gibberish and what Emma just said is that she's fine with not riding as long as it means that her best friend's gonna be okay. Jupiter's gonna be okay, Emma. He seems like a very strong horse. He is a strong horse. <laughs> oh, that one was a little bit more difficult to understand, but I think she just said he is a strong horse. Thank you. I'll come back out to check on him in a few days. So just for now, make sure that he has plenty of water, no food for the day, and just lots of rest. No riding until next Sunday. Okay, thank you. You're welcome, Emma, but you can groom him to spend some quality time with him. Thanks for being a good boy, Jupiter. <laughs> thank you for everything you just did, Beth. Lily, you know I was just doing my job. <laughs> Um, I know that you will had the show tomorrow, but Jupiter won't be able to participate. Uh, I know. Emma was just so excited about the show. I was gonna let her do cross country. Are you showing Titan tomorrow? No, I didn't have plans to. Well, why doesn't she ride him then? I'll bring the idea up to her. Thank you. Man, don't scare us like that again, okay, Jupiter? We love you too much. <laughs> Emma, do you need help with anything? No, that's okay. Um, I'm gonna groom him, and y'all need to get packed for the show tomorrow. Well, I don't want to do the show if you can't do it. Molly, you know I appreciate the loyalty in your friendship. But you have to do the show. I'm still gonna go and support everyone. Emma, you can ride Chubbs. Uh, Mia, who would you ride then? Oh, uh, I ain't got no idea. That's a really good point. It's okay, y'all. As long as Jupiter is happy and healthy, I am perfectly fine. I love supporting y'all. We'll be sure to all do our absolute best for you, okay, Emma? Woo! My elementary school cheerleading skills are gonna come in handy! Oh no! <laughs> Not elementary school cheerleading! Woo! I was so good at it! I vividly remember you trying to fight someone on the football team. Whoa! Don't act like Joey didn't deserve it. He totally brought that on himself. Emma, can I talk to you for a second? Oh, of course, Miss Lily. Let me just put Jupiter away. Come on, bud. What's up, Miss Lily? I know how excited you were for the show this weekend, and now that you can't compete, I just feel really bad. Miss Lily, it's okay. As long as Jupiter's healthy, I am perfectly fine. I promise I am not bothered. I love being able to support my friends. Well, we do have some options, though. I'm not riding Titan, so if you wanted to ride him, you could show him in the dressage section. Or I could ask my dad and see if he knows anybody that might have a pony that we can borrow for cross country. <laughs> Titan? I'm so not qualified to do that! Or if your parents are okay with it, we could find you another pony to borrow for the weekend. Ugh, I just, I kind of feel like I'd be cheating on Jupiter, you know? Like, we've got such a bond going. Would that be wrong? No, it wouldn't be wrong. I'm sure Jupiter wants you to compete and help your team out. Uh, okay, well, if your dad can find another pony that I could show cross country on, I think that'd be amazing. I've always wanted to try the cross country course at Diamond Tea. All right, I'll see what I can do. Now, girls, go ahead and get ready, okay? We'll all meet at the showgrounds tomorrow. I'll have all the horses ready to go. Oh, I'm so nervous. I might just vomit right now. Mia, please don't do that. I might. This is literally the fanciest barn I've ever been at. Hi dog, and I thought Fox Shop Farms was fancy. Oh, they got the white fences here. Wow, they've clearly never been anywhere because this is so not fancy. This is literally like a backyard barn. It's disgusting. Emma, look, it's the horse Miss Lily got you to ride. <gasps> He's on his oh my gosh, that's Pirate, he's my brother. I ate my sibling in the womb. You know, there's some things in life that you don't have to share, and that's actually one of them. Alpha sibling! Oh. Alright, Emma, here's Pirate. He's so cute! 
He's pretty handsome. What's really cool though is he's actually Barry's younger brother. He just specializes in cross country. Oh, Barry, you're here. Nice to see you again. It's good to see you too, pirate. How have you been? Well, currently I have some grubby little child's hands on my nose, but other than that, I've been great. Oh, <laughs> that's Emma. Her horse Jupiter's actually sick right now, but she's a good one. She's gonna be riding you. She kind of smells like Cheetos. Oh yeah, she loves those. I'm Sparrow. I'm Lady. Nice to meet you. Chubs. I'm Cinnamon. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, yeah, I'm not gonna stand too close to the cinnamon one. I feel like he might bite me. Oh, he will. I think he likes you. Come on, let's hop on. Oh, I'm so excited for the cross-country course. He really looks like you're gonna have a blast out there. <laughs> okay, he's definitely shorter than Jupiter, but this is really nice. All right, we need to head to the warm-up arena. You girls stay here and keep watching, okay? Learn your courses. Now entering the arena is number 582, Sammy White riding bullet train. <laughs> she just, she's supposed to jump it, right? <laughs> oh my god, you're being so loud right now. Great, looks like Tiff and her little minion are over there. Honestly, as long as they stay over there and don't come over here, I think we're okay. <gasps> Those two mean girls are coming over. <laughs> blah, 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 I live in a foxy, moxy, foxy, fox, fox rocks, fox. Uh, what, what are they? Oh my god, you're so stupid. Fox not farms. <laughs> Tiff. Molly. Hi, Stacy. Oh my god, hi, Mia. <laughs> um, you're missing one. Where's the one who always wants to fight people? Emma? Her horse Jupiter's sick, so she's trying out a new one for the show. Uh, yawn, like I even care. Why'd you just waste my time explaining that? Because you literally asked. Uh, no, I didn't. <laughs> no, she didn't. Actually, she did. <gasps> Sarah, I love you. <laughs> I know, everyone does. Still riding with the land of misfit toys, are we now, Sarah? I'm gonna say this in the nicest way I possibly could. Maybe if your parents hadn't dropped y'all on your heads, then you'd be able to understand that these girls are much better equestrians than you ever will be. It's kind of a uh, backhanded compliment, but I'll take it. <gasps> Who told you that? I'm just gonna let you know that when we beat you today, it's just gonna show that you're gonna be another forgotten equestrian. I think what you mean to say is that when we beat you, we're never gonna let you forget. <gasps> I didn't think about that. Now why don't you go scurry back to your trainer like the rats you are. Miss Ashley, they're bullying us! Sarah. Thank you. Don't ever expect that to happen again, okay? All right, Mia, it's your turn. Miss Lily, I might throw up. You can't tell me that you're nervous because you have been doing amazing in our lessons. Now, come on, we can't be late. You're gonna do great, Mia, you've got this. All right, Mia, you know the course, just wait for them to announce you and you're good to go. Now, if anything happens, just trust Chubbs because he knows his job and he will help you out. Now entering the arena is number 125, Mia Hartshorn riding couch potato. All right, Chubbs, come on, that's us. We're almost done, Chubbs. Oh Yo, my God, Mia! Mia. Yeah. Mia, that was so good. Really? Because, I mean, I blacked out halfway through, so I really don't remember half the course that I just did. <laughs> you know what? That's fine. That's fine. All right, stay here, because they're about to announce the results for the cross rails. Now it's time to announce our results for our cross rail open class. In second place, we have Sammy White riding bullet train. In first place, we have Mia Hartschwarm riding couch potato. Mia! Oh gosh, Mia, yeah! Oh, I got first on my, are you sure? Mia, that's awesome. All right, you are done for the day. Now it's time to become a cheerleader. Are you excited? I can't wait to get off. I've been on this horse for way too long. Now calling cross country riders one through five to the starting gate. Oh man, that's us! You know your course, Emma, right? Oh heck yeah, cross-country courses are so easy! Uh, I also wrote it down on my arm just in case. Well, I'm, I'm sure that's fine. <laughs> I'm gonna stay up here and help the other girls jump, okay? Good luck, you're gonna do amazing. He's just like riding Jupiter. Thanks, Miss Lily. Good luck, Good luck Emma. Emma. You've got this. Sophie, Molly, y'all are next. Come on. Now entering the arena is number 222, Molly Mulbeck riding Captain Jack. Good luck, Molly. Don't choke. Or do! <laughs> Ignore them, Molly. You've got this. Thanks, Sophie. Come on, Sparrow. Go, Molly! Woo! Uh, I thought 
thought she was gonna knock down a rail. Molly, oh my gosh, that was literally the best round you've ever done. All right, just go ahead and hang out up here so that you can cheer on Sophie and then also wait for the results. You've got this, Sophie. As long as you keep your eyes up in the turn, you're fine. Eyes up in the turn, okay. Now entering the arena is number 117, Sophie Callahan, riding My Fair Lady. <laughs> I don't understand how they're doing so good. I know what we need to do. Sophie! Sorry everyone, my mom just told me that she bought me a new Louis Vuitton show jacket, so like how else would you react? Sophie, are you okay? Ow. Yeah, I'm okay. What even happened? It sounded like a little kid screamed and then it spooked Lady. I'm gonna talk to the judge and see if you can get a re-ride. Thank you, Miss Lily. Come on, Lady, let's go. You okay, Sophie? Yeah, I'm good. I just don't really understand why people bring their little kids to horse shows if they just scream like that. It's okay, lady. I know you didn't mean it. Come on, let me get back on. <laughs> and that's how it's done. Oh my god, that was like so bad to the bone. <laughs> I know. Now shut up and go. <laughs> on my way. Now entering the arena is Stacy Stroganoff riding Mount Olympus. Okay, Zeus, come on. It's time to play Hunter Rider. Let's go. Oh my goodness, Tiff, did you see us? We did so good. <laughs> yeah, whatever, it was fine. Let's just hear what place you get. Sophie, I talked to the judge and she said that she's not gonna allow you to have a re-ride because apparently she didn't hear a kid scream. That's okay, Miss Lily. I really appreciate you trying. I mean, it was blatantly obvious that Cindy was the one who screamed. Cindy as in the girl from Shockwave Stables? Yeah, I mean, she even rambled on about how she got some Louis Vuitton show jacket. I'm gonna have to talk with the judge again. Where are you going? We're about to go. Oh my goodness, Cindy. Just give me like five seconds, okay? Ugh, whatever. We have your placings for the 2-6 open. In first place, we have Stacy Stroganoff on Mount Olympus. And in second place, we have Molly Volbeck on Captain Jack. Thank you, riders. Well, at least we had fun before I fell off. What sucks is that that round was amazing. Cindy cannot just get away with this. I'm not gonna stoop down to her level and spook her horse. Come on, let's go watch. Riders, please prepare for our three foot class. Where's your trainer? Fox Snot Farms is supposed to go first. Actually, Tiff, for this round, you're going first. <laughs> oh, I'll be sure to set the bar so high, neither of y'all even come close. <laughs> Now entering the arena is number 825, Tiffany White on War Commander. All right, girls, you know your course? Where have you been? I was handling something, thank you very much. All right, who wants to go first? Cindy does. What's the, no I don't. All right, Cindy, show face, let's go. I don't wanna go first. <laughs> Good luck, you're gonna need it. Now entering the arena is number 114, Cindy Jackson riding Cinnamon Spice. have the patience for this. You better get up before your pony runs you over. Yeah, thanks for asking if I'm okay. Ah! Whoa, easy cinnamon. Cindy, get up and get out of the arena. But the sand is so nice. Mmm, yay, sand. Ugh. Can you ask the judge if I can have a re-ride? Absolutely not, because that was 100% your fault. You were the one who spurred Cinnamon off the ground and then she jumped how she was supposed to and you lost your balance. Ugh, whatever. Come on, Cinnamon. <laughs> ah, stupid pony, I'm asking mom and dad for a new one. Whoa, did Cindy fall off? Yeah, in her usual Cindy way. I fell off too. Oh no, you and Lady have been doing so good. What happened? Tiff screamed to spook Lady in the middle of the round. I honestly don't know how y'all put up with that Tiff girl because she is absolutely nasty. If she was in my grade, I would have already thrown hands and probably just bit her at this point. 
we have to remember that she has a terrible home life and she only acts this way because this is the only way that she can get attention. Still not an excuse. How was the cross country course? It was amazing! Also, I am incredibly obsessed with Pirate Dog. He's so cool! <laughs> Yeah, I am pretty cool, aren't I? Now entering the show ring is number 357, Sarah Bentley on Strawberry Shortcake. All right, Sarah, you've got this. Just keep your eyes up in the corner and trust your pony. Okay. Oh, Sarah's going. Even if she is mean, she can really ride. Good girl, Barry. We have your results for the three foot open class and in first place we have Sarah Bentley riding strawberry shortcake. You're telling me that I didn't even place? Probably because the judge found out that you screamed during Sophie's round. Bad sportsmanship. Emma, you got second in cross country. That's amazing. Ah, I'm in love with this horse. Thank you to all of our riders who participated in the show today. We have the results of the team competition. In first place, we have Foxtrot Farms. In second place, we have Shockwave Stables. In third place, we have Pony Point Palace. Oh, oh my gosh! I didn't think that we could do it. Woo! Oh my god, we did it! We got second! Shut up.